Not every company can boast a rich heritage, but today Godfrey Syrett was celebrating 70 years of furniture making with the opening of a brand new showroom. Started by Ken Godfrey and Harry Syrett on the very same site in North Tyneside, the company has now gone from strength to strength. I think very proud and, and I think it's a testament to the company that you know, over those 70 years have been many challenges and the company have uh, slowly but surely evolved into new business sectors. We now service, we still work with the NHS, as I say 70 years on, but we've now gone into student accommodation, educational furniture, we supply the MOD. So a very proud moment. I'm just delighted to know that they're just going from strength to strength and that's wonderful in these times of austerity that this company is just growing and growing. It's about the quality and the people there who are passionate about what they're doing and telling the story about this company, which is wonderful. Bill Noakes started at the firm 53 years ago and can still remember what it was like on his very first day. I can remember that day just like it was yesterday. Believe it or not, I think I come for the interview with my mum. <laughs> <laughs> That's straight that. I come for the interview with my mum and um, at the time Malcolm says, well you can take your coat off now, hang it up and get a start work on that machine there, like you know, and I thought, wow, I don't even know how to press it on, never mind work it. Like When I first started like in the assembly, we used to use tax skin pins. We used to get a handful, shove them in your mouth, get your hammer which was magnetised and hammer them in like that. Thank God the compressors and all that come around and the guns come around because it saved a heck of a lot of time. The robotic techniques now used in the warehouse mean that Godfrey Syrett is now looking ahead to a homegrown future of manufacturing and continuing to be part of the region's DNA. The most important thing to us is the next 70 years. So with that, we develop a, a continuous uh, improvement culture. We're always looking for the best practice within manufacture. We were formed in 1947, the year after the NHS was formed in 46 to service the NHS with tables and chairs. As the business has grown and developed, markets have grown and developed as well. The company has invested over three million pound in the last two years in the most up-to-date and modern manufacturing techniques, uh, incorporating robotic and CNC machinery, automizing processes. And that said though, to this day, the people within the business are still the most important factor. We're probably one of the you know, the best um, innovative manufacturers in the Northeast. There can't be many companies that, in fact, in the UK who've got such a heritage. We've got long-standing relationships, we've got the loyalty of the staff, and we, but we are very forward-thinking, and I think that's a mix that's hard to find. I think it's a big thank you to everybody who's worked for the business over the last 70 years, and I think they're, they're a big part of us being here today, and we look forward, hopefully, to another 70 years.